Hey everyone, how's it going? My name is James, and the other day when I was playing Studio on Black Ops 2 in the new Uprising DLC map pack, I came across an awesome line of sight that actually counters a giant camping spot and gets enemies off the B flag. Now, what's so cool about this line of sight, you can easily get free kills, the enemy can't see you, they have no clue where you are, and they're definitely not going to suspect you being there. So, you know, this is pretty much one of the best lines of sight I've ever seen in this game, and a lot of people don't actually know about it. Now, I don't usually like to post videos on lines of sight, lots of other people do that, but I've never seen this line of sight anywhere, and it's such an important one because, well, it definitely counters the giant tower. Whenever you think of Firing Range or Studio, the new name for it, you think of the tower. It's such a powerful place you can control the spawns in the Firing Range by B flag, you can control all that, pretty much a good half or one third of the map you can control just from camping in that tower. It's really hard to get people out of there, it's definitely up high, and if you want to climb up the ladder, you leave yourself prone to getting shot while climbing up. You know, it's such a fast paced map, and you definitely have to leave yourself open while climbing up that giant ladder, not to mention getting past and sneaking up behind the enemy who's camping on top. Now, with that being said, I actually came across this, and I'm going to be showing it on screen right now. All you have to do is run up by the bathrooms on the one side by the runway. I'm using the old terms. I'm sorry about that. I'm still, you know, used to the old firing range. This old kind of stucco-like building with, like, the tannish color, and hop on top of the wall. You'll hop over the wall and hop onto some trucks. I'm using this with a sniper scope right now. You can look over, and you'll actually have a clear view in your sniper scope of the tower, but the enemy will not be suspecting you. They will not see you all the way across the map, and you can easily take them out with a sniper. Now, it does work with other guns, and what's also awesome about this spot is you can hop up and throw a grenade onto B and easily kill the enemies on the B. So not only can you, you know, take out people on the tower, but you can get some free kills on B too. This definitely is a giant help, and like I said, no one really expects it, so you can easily pick up some free kills. Now, I did test this out with a few other guns. As you see, I'm using it with the Chai Cum right now. It works just fine. It does take a few more kills since it is a submachine gun and a longer range. Like, if you were using something like a Burst Fire AA-94, you could easily take people out with one or two shots especially to the head. Now what's also cool is if you're trying to get the long shot challenges for your assault rifles, this spot actually counts as a long shot, so you can sit up there and wait for an enemy or find an enemy and shoot them and actually get some long shot medals off that too. So that's awesome. You can get some gun challenges done while countering campers and, you know, pretty much playing the objective and picking up some free easy kills. Now, a cool little thing I found out actually, I went to go try it out and it actually works in Call of Duty Black Ops 1 too. So for some reason you ever feel like going to, you know, do a little bit of a throwback and play that game and play the old firing range, that line of sight actually works in that game too. It's actually in both the maps, the new and the old firing range range and studio that's about it if you enjoyed this line of sight you know make sure to leave a like i don't like to post this stuff too much i definitely think it's covered by a lot of other people and uh but this is something i really found out and i think it's awesome and i haven't seen it anywhere else so if you're this video make sure to leave a like and if you didn't that's all right too also if you're new around here and want to stay up to date make sure to subscribe you definitely won't regret it that's about it and have a great day everyone